run off on my own. I was being proactive. Too proactive. And we almost died because of it. And that's how Ooh. it's done. Eh, me exploding stuff is still better. It's really not. <laughs> Next time we're in a huge fight, you're gonna beg me to blow stuff up. Bag me! Next time we're in a huge fight, I'll make sure to remember that. Jesus. This guy. More of that weird fog. Be glad you ain't this close to the ground. Oh, little fuzzy <laughs> never dies from gas in here. Just falling, crushing, to towery, Wait, water. Hang on. Oh. See Shatari? Oh, I did, didn't I? Such a funny sounding word. I've never had to part of the thing. But I'm Mr. Man. This is impossible! I thought I'd never see these lurkers again! I hoped I never would! <laughs> you got this one! Beggars be scut knuckles would be hiding you underground! You could have warned us that Shatari were hiding out in this cave! They aren't always! <laughs> Sometimes we just run into cute little eyeball guys! You know the ones I'm talking about, <laughs> I'm familiar with eyeball guys, yes. But I don't oh, get here. Feel free to ask him. Man, what is this like the sure one? Sure. Oh, I don't want to think about how they got here. Somebody call an exterminator. Well, the Ooh. sword lady's being crazy again. With our luck, Hellbender's goons are on the other side, just waiting to jump us! Payback from Hellbender is literally the last thing we need right now! Ha! Hold it! Can you save your ex-Holdy son for when we're not being shot at? Won't these guys know that left bygones get bygones? Hey! At least they didn't bring an army of them jelly things with them! Can you imagine? Man, I hated those things! You were saying? <laughs> just had to jinx us, didn't you? Hey, anyone notice if this happens to be the monster I said? I suppose you want credit for that, too? <laughs> Dark, pointing death coming your way! Yeah, they didn't have one. Watch it, Spike! Get him down, Bruce! Big, big, big up. More you wanna go. This is a long way to go for a few measly units! <laughs> you need a few thousand units! Ooh. What's next, Peter? Could this get any worse? Sure! We could be dealing with our churchified noble weirdos too! Ah, that would be worse! Oh, oh no! <laughs> I can't believe so many of them fell for the promise! So did one of our own, remember? How could I know? Let's keep swatting them! Okay, this is officially too weird! Hey, can't blame this one on me! Rocket man! What else can this place possibly throw at us? I would rather not find out! <laughs> Oh, 
for the Nova Corps track now. Music to my ears. <laughs> Let's go down. There we go. I can't so many of them fell for the promise. There we go. Bog of fear. Faced fully forthright. You okay, Mantis? <laughs> oh, hey, Gamora. You look less <laughs> depressed. Yeah. Wait, we went over that already, didn't we? <laughs> yeah. yeah, we did. That thing of yours is still bothering you, though, right? What thing? I'm fine. Let's just focus on helping Drax. <laughs> He's gonna be upset he didn't get to fight all those things. Uh, I don't think that any of those were real. Not really real anyway. Their attacks felt real enough. Maybe they were real. There's something down here that's affecting my vision. Don't think it was ever that clear to begin. Just how far down does this cave go? Legends say the entire planet is hollow! Heads up! More than rock monsters. Oh, I don't think they're looking to make a man squill. Oh, wait, maybe I can help. I think I see their language. <laughs> this is how it's done. I told you to go before we left the ship. <laughs> oh. Come in. Holy shit. up the word for kill or the grunt anyway <laughs> the fog doesn't seem to bother whatever these giant things are maybe they're just smart enough to not wander around in it unlike some people I, am Groot. I know why we're doing it and don't think Drax won't hear all about it either oh is this the one where little fuzzy does something heroic hard to say I think it's pretty easy to say he won't you most of all could be willing to give someone I'm sure that it's not, but let's not tell Star Guy. He needs to learn from me. I can <laughs> hear you! If we do cure Dragons, right. we should make up a story about how we battled some epic one of a kind monster. Shit. Well, you won't have to make that up. Just gonna uh, assume you got your timeline crossed again.
Is that it? You joking? There's no box. I'll have to tell the priests about the big baddies down here. Once we cure Drax, maybe we could capture a couple. What the flock for? Don't know. Maybe give them the Hellbender as a peace offering. There's actually no reason to come. Oh, damn it! Thought I found some coal. Ah, there it is. Tiny. It's a. This looks like something Gamora could use. So it's like a tiny doll. Hmm. How can an entire planet be hollow? Doesn't it need a core or something for gravity or atmosphere? Got any other science words you want to throw out there, Gamora? <laughs> Electromagnetic field? <laughs> um, guys. I know, little fuzzy. And it is the only way forward. Golden plus blue again. Hmm. Hips, quips. Okay. What's happening? He sees what lies ahead, and I see what lies behind. Uh -uh. Hmm. No way. No flarkin' way. Doesn't seem that wet. Like <laughs> medium wet. I ain't walking through a flarkin' monsoon. Maybe there's a way to use those plants to divert the water. We're a team. We'll figure it out. Are we seriously gonna let this keep us from saving tracks? Sure! You save him while I drown! How does it even grow down here? I don't know. But those big leaves could be useful. Like a dam. Dam what? No, it's... <laughs> it's just a plant plant, not a you plant. <laughs> what would you guys do without me? Yeah, where oh where will we get another gun? And... Ugh, crap. It must still be stuck somewhere. Interesting. Gamora, let's climb up there. Get eyes on the problem. The problem is that Rocky needs to suck it up. Yeah, good luck with that. In Little Fuzzy's defense, he has died drowning in far less water than this. Exactly. <laughs> Wait, what? This doesn't seem absurd to you? He's got a thing with water. What do you want me to do? You're supposed to be his leader. Have you met Rocket? Oh, my God. Star Lord. Say something. God, nope. <laughs> Who's that? Who's that? You. Just like that. Please, don't give him an even bigger head than he's already got. No, it ain't none of their business. Too bad you don't have these sweet guns, Rocket. Keep it up and I'll swipe them in your sleep. I could try blowing it up, I guess. No! Remember last time you blew something up? Okay, fine. Figure something else out. <laughs> Making sure I'm not missing any collectibles. I don't have to get up to that side now. We're looking to shoot from here. What's a big ass plant doing all the way down here? The priest called Nice shot, Peter! Oh, uh, thanks! That's why they call me Star Lord! I'm gonna be aware of that one. Sure. Huh? What's your hurry? I am the root. 
What? I told you to go before we left the ship. Yes. Can't believe that worked. Half work. Come on, it's like 50% less wet. I'm 0% interested. Right. Hey, bug lady. Exactly how many times you seen us die horribly? Oh, it's too sad to count. I always have to stop around 50. Great! That's ten apiece! Oh, no, 50,000, little fuzzy. Jesus. Ah, uh, this is all I got. This Good stuff. Bird, could you help a brother out? Hey, Groot. He ain't gonna let you leave me. It's not that. I just want some help up here. All right, he'll do it. <laughs> hey. Sure, they're big enough to block the water, but they're growing in the wrong direction. Hey, if I jump, you can catch me, right? Guess we'll find out. That's not very reassuring. <laughs> wow, I don't know why. <laughs> why don't we just leave him behind? Focus on saving Drax. He'll still be here on the way back, and if he isn't, eh. Groot would never go for that. What are you guys talking about? Nothing, buddy. You're a valued member of the team. Okay. I really used to go there just to um, shoot things that I think I shot from the ground. But I was just checking for collectibles, like I do. What do you say, Groot? Now that we got the whole team together? I am Groot. Absolutely. A dry rocket is a happy rock. <laughs> this is you happy? Oh, yes. You should see some of the dark versions of Little Fuzzy. Or maybe you shouldn't. You really, really shouldn't. <laughs> Uh, Rocket, can you help us out, buddy? Oh, buddy, old pal. This crab corridor ring any bells, Mantis? I'm pretty sure this is the wet part. The what now? I thought we just did the wet part. Oh, it gets worse. Much worse. Guys. It is. Oh shit. Oh, it's <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Everyone okay? I'd be seeing stars if I could see anything at all. <laughs> yeah, this ain't good. So, about all them futures where we die. I am <gasps> Has he always been able to do that? I am he says he don't like showing off. Thanks, buddy. I am no, I don't gotta tell him. Oh, right. The thing. That you tell us in the dark. It's really important. No, it ain't. Shut up! I am You're among friends, Rocket. It's nothing, okay? Just... The lab I was in did tests on me in tubes of water. And it sucked. It really, really sucked. Sensory deprivation experiments on Half-World. I heard of those. Sensory deprivation was like a vacation compared to the other things. And that's why you hate getting wet. Mark. I had no idea. Don't make a big deal out of it. Just prefer to keep dry is all. Rocket, something's wrong with my visor. I can't see anything. Huh. Must be Groot's bioluminescence. It ain't on the defined light spectrum. Uh, right. So how long do we gotta wander around smashing our shins mm -hmm. on rocks? Imagine Sorry guys, that's far left outside. You're in the physical darkness, and that reflects Green like Mini's mind. We can double back along Groot's path and then try to button. find the exit. Groot says stay close to him. At least you'll be able to see. Okay, so I changed my voice cancelling settings a little bit. So that might work. Oh, I need to get up there then. Huh? There's a box there. One more, can you cut through these? So Look at you blow. You're welcome. I had no idea Flora Colossi could become bioluminescent. There's a lot about him you don't know. Oh. 
because I really want that bat. You know me playing this? I want that bat. It's gonna be a bit difficult. Uh -huh. You sure that's the right way, Peter? Yep, totally. I'm sure that it's not, but let's not tell Star Guy. He needs to learn for himself. I can hear you. Hey, annihilation <laughs> Classic Guardian. Of course. I've no doubt I'll do a new game quest. Oh boy, this place is so creepy. Remember the deal, Quill. You find anything shiny, we split it. Ooh, Is this the one? This part. Ooh. Okay, anyone else getting really fed up with little Miss Cryptic? Pretty? <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> This low light is almost romantic. Kind of like our first date, Star Guy. Is there really a timeline where you actually date Peter? At least it seems less dark through here and less wet. Works for me. Mantis, anything in particular we should be looking out for? I'm trying to remember. I think this is where it gets loopy. Oh, uh, there's that creepy fog again. Sorry, guys, that's just, you know. It's fog. always here. Always. I'm gonna mute my mic. <laughs> What's that supposed to. Shh. I don't. More Hellraisers. Wait, yeah. But it ain't those Flarknards. It's them creepy eyeball things from the QZ. I'm definitely hearing Hellraisers. Then you ain't hearing right. It's eyeball things. I can't tell. It's not clear. Well, it's clear to me. Moore's gotta be right. We already know Hellbender's goons tracked us here. has a mind of its own. Not mind. Force. Can we go back? I'm not even sure we're back with Lee. Anyone else getting deja vu? It all looks the same with this fog. Well, it don't sound the same. It's them jelly things from Seknar. That explains Stumpy's cousin. No, it's Novacor. I hear voices. How can you not tell the difference between monsters and people? Moore's right. I hear voices, just like when I put on that helmet in the Nova base. You're both crazy. No fucking way! I heard jelly! It doesn't matter who Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. At least there's a way out now, I guess. Okay, now that's them bouncing eyeballs from the QC. No question. I'm not doing this. Something is clearly messing with us. Shitari? Okay, well, that's just wrong. You're worse than her. Those overgrown lizards make clicky sounds. You got moss in your ears. I'm with Groot. Shatari. Never forget those things as long as I live. This ain't no time to close. It's like Amora said. Something's messing with us. Look out! Nice to meet you! Sir. Sure. 
Oh, my back. Okay, cool. Okay, and the second I unmute, that starts in color. Cool. I don't put my noise cancelling too high. Because I'll start to fade out weirdly for you guys. So. We can't keep doing this. What are we supposed to do? Ignore it? This isn't right. It can't be real. Sure felt real when we were fighting them. It's the fog. They're just sounds. I definitely hear more of Hellbender's goons. <laughs> what I should do, uh, really, is not say anything. Okay. So we're there. Because this time it did actually give me the opportunity to say anything. Last time. We're gonna stay silent and nothing will happen. That was the first time I gave me the choice to say. Yeah, I hear it. But what is it? This isn't right. It can't be real. Sure felt real when we were fighting them. It's the fog. They're just sounds. And it's just a coincidence. They sound like all the flock and scut bags that have tried to kill us recently. Shh. What do you mean? Shh. Still was right. Shh. Right about what? Shh. Hey. So it was nothing. I think it depends. It's got something to do with the freaky fog. Every time you name an enemy, it has the power to make that enemy appear. So the key all along was to keep. Quiet? Yeah, like that was ever gonna happen. I saw so many versions of us fighting with so many different things. With the sword? It's not done with us yet, Guardian. Yeah, well, let's just keep our eyes open and our mouths shut from now on. The fog entity has retreated for now. There's no immediate risk. Yeah, no offense, bug lady, but nothing you say means anything anymore. So the fog is an entity now? Yes! Obviously, if some fog monster's trying to kill us, it means we're getting closer to whatever it is we're looking for. That kind of makes sense. And if this fog monster can make bad things appear, maybe the opposite is true. Like if we all say cure Drax, maybe that's what we've been looking for the whole time. I wish, Star Guy, <laughs> but no. The one time she gives a definite <laughs> answer. <laughs> Possible timeline, we all get smushed. Great. Oh, thanks, Mantis. How insightful. Let me guess. Further down. Only if you want to save that and the whole galaxy. Let me get back to you. <laughs> uh oh. You hear that? Okay. I don't remember this part. Okay, okay. Look, guys, um, <clears throat> I appreciate what you all did for me back there with the water thing, um, but following the bug lady any deeper is officially stupid. Rocket. No. Fog monsters? Cave pigs? Wet waterfalls? Technically, all water. <laughs> no, no, Quill. <laughs> she doesn't know where we are. She doesn't know where we're going. She doesn't know what we're looking for. Mantis, are we hot or cold? Room temperature. Okay, <gasps> okay. This is crazy. He is probably crazy. It's not about her, it's about us. I am super proud of us. Because we've never gone this far for anything before. Oh, this is the one where you inspire them. Just think about who we were when we started. Um, well, you were a two-bit broke pirate who couldn't even outrun a tree. Exactly. And you were a two-bit bounty hunter. Just as broke as me. Just as depraved, self-centered, mindlessly um, chasing every unit, yes? bar, contract, bank to rob. I still like many of those things. So do I. But none of those things are why we're here now, right? 
You're down here kicking ass for Drax. Not Drax the Destroyer, not Drax the Rampaging Criminal. Drax, man! Our friend. And Gamora. You've gone to the ends of the galaxy to hunt people, to hurt people. To get revenge in what I can only assume are some excruciatingly painful ways. <laughs> but doesn't this feel kind of good? Going this far to help someone you care about? Oh, it feels so good. <laughs> I grew. Uh, he says you don't have to. No, no, I do. Because we all need to learn something from you, man. You never complain. But, or if you do, I don't catch it. But I, I, I'm pretty <laughs> sure you probably definitely don't. You're always there for us. And that's what this is about. Us. Growing together as a team, following a crazy lady into a death cave because one of us needs help. Because we are a team. Help, we're a family. We're the fucking guardians of the galaxy. <laughs> really great speech, Quill. Why didn't anyone stop me? You're on such a roll! It really was one of your better speeches. We grew it on the line, he might have. Shit, man. Convince Rocket to enter the water in hole. Rock, 
Okay, look, Rocket! I know Shut you. up, Quill! I know what I gotta do, and I'm just gonna... Really? I'm gonna suck it up and do it! Come on, man. You got this. You got this, Rocket! <laughs> Please work, please work. Come on, Rocky, you can do this. You can, right, Mantis? Mantis! Hell yeah. Let's put it down. Did that for us. Hey, a friend needed help. Oh yeah. Bunch more. Rocket, man. Yeah, yeah. Can we please just save Drax already? <laughs> warm. Very, very warm. I think she wants us to jump in the hole. I may not know what we're looking for, but I know it's down there. Okay, let's finish this, because I sure as flock didn't get all wet for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> let's do we it. Something sad and sulking, licking lingering wounds. <laughs> if it's here, she's totally gonna feed us something awful. <laughs> no, should we expect a fight? Probably. You guys aren't very good at the whole de escalation thing. You're kidding. Even with our prize negotiator over here, it doesn't matter what's down here. If it can bring us back our grumpy Catathian, I'm all in. And the rest of you should be too. Come on, guys. We're the freaking guardians of the galaxy. Um, is that supposed to be me? I heard you make that speech so many times. And then Gamora says something like, We're going to need Drax? Uh-huh. And then little Fuzzy says, We're here. Home of the healing light. Source of the cure. Origin of Raker's power. It's a cocoon? Hold it. You're going to feed us to some giant bug. Or maybe he's the bug, and that's some kind of external digestion sack or something. <laughs> you realize this is weird, right? Oh, it gets weirder. The Adam Warlock, please. What the... Oh, gross! Please tell me Drax is the only one who's got to go in that creepy egg sack. So the shepherds found fresh flock. Mad. Holy shit. Yeah, good luck, guys. Foolish followers. Think fast, beard butt. How the? That is bearded. You know not the gravity of your treacherous trespass. <laughs> Not quell a god. <laughs> Prepare for oblivion, interloper. Oh, what's this one? Okay, Green Rainy, you're up. <sighs> Found you. Nasty uglies from that busted noggin of yours. Mm. It's okay, guys. It's him, Aaron Witchcraft. <laughs> 
<laughs> no. Wait. In Warsock. Ashley Warsaw. Adam Warlock? That's it! The Golden God guy! Hold on. Sick. This guy's Raker's old divine whatever? Looks pretty good for a dead guy. <laughs> Were you not sent by the sanctimonious shepherd? Us? With Raker? Not a chance. We're trying to shut his ass down. See? Friends. Okay, big guy. And we go. Come on! All the ones where we die already happened. <laughs> oh, this is cool. This is cool. Oh. <sighs> Raker's got half the galaxy going cuckoo bananas. Her friend included. I swapped your ass for a newer, younger, blue skinned model. So. Can you help us? Mantis seems to think you can cure Drax. My heavenly healing is veiled malignance. A first folly I swore never to repeat. Ugh, can someone translate this guy? He said no. Looks like the protection I can needed. proffer is to remain reclusive. Not this time, Goldie. The pieces need to go back together. We just gotta get you all closer to the puzzle. And that would be... In here, of course. Whoa, wait, let, let's talk about... That's what Drax is heading. What? The butt! It's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. Welcome to the Astral <laughs> Plains, Snorlord. You teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your minds. Merged our what? I gave no consent to this, Planescaper. <laughs> She's not big on asking permission. It's all pretty sure this and fate of the galaxy that. Don't you get huffy, god guy. Your gold hands are all over this mess. What's that supposed to mean? I thought this guy was how we cure Drax. Cure and cause can coalesce. Uh, guys? Is that Drax? <laughs> So we're going into Drax's head. Literally. Green Meanie's in there somewhere. Find him, then convince him to come back to reality. Uh, Mantis, please tell me we're supposed to be going into the bright light. Pretty sure. You need to reach the heart of Drax's promise. Much deeper than I've ever seen. Wait, if you've never seen it, does that mean it never happens? Hope not. Just keep going. And if we lose contact, listen to Amy Winsaw. She means you. Quite clearly, 